Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nifo29 and here's what's in our backpack. We're overweight, but there's a reason. Um, I'm going to drop these. I added them both to the radial so we can get rid of them. Clothing's all good. There's why we're overweight. I have a bunch of meat. I figured why not have scent while we're doing this, right? Um... We can fill you. Ooh. 29. Look at that. <laughs> and there's what's in our backpack. Thanks for the resub, Murd. Tier 3. Does that say 16 months? Wow. Um, we're on day 77 and here's our school, our, our schools. Here's our schools. There they are. <laughs> uh, y'all are messing me up. We've already had a resub. We've had a coffee slurp before the stream even started. We got 10 minutes on this. And I woke up way early. Oh my god, my cats were going nuts at like 5 this morning. <laughs> Just ripping. They got the zoomies. One of them, I think it was CJ. Let's leave that. Uh, is there anything I gotta do? There's nothing I didn't think. Uh, oh. Um... Let's get rid of y'all. We'll put you there. We'll put you... Eh, it's good enough. Alright. We're gonna go up the hill. Do we have a scent? How much? Oh. That's not who I wanted to attract. Oh, wow. I'm bringing her in from everywhere. Well, I was kind of hoping to bring the bear close, but oh, this isn't going to go well. <laughs> is that guy not running at me, is he? Retreat. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's not what I was trying to do. How's my clothing? 89, that's good. Bedrolls at 77. Uh, well, let's make one of you. What I was trying to... Whoa. I was trying to bring the bear closer, right? Are you, like, right there? Is that you? No, that's just a rock. Drink up. Um, actually... Let's drop you. How close... Can we get you? Like, does this... Is this gonna be close enough to heat it? Alright. Put you away. No, that's not going to be close enough. And I can't reach there. Let's do that. Actually, to be honest, I think I just want to make a new one. I'm going to go in here. Would be a great time to have a rock. Maybe don't. All 
Alright, we gotta take that. I think he's on the other side. Oh, he's just on the other side of the hill. Two. Two of the four. There's three of the four. Now, where did the other guy go? You know what? Let's go up. Uh, let's get rid of the saplings and we'll get rid of the hides. What time is it? Early morning. And we'll come back and we'll grab some meat and go. Wow. It's a nice day. What is the temperature? Minus 11. It's a nice day. Yeah, I see those rocks over there. But I'm not gonna take them because I don't do stuff like that. That's too smart. When I need a rock, I want to know that I don't have one and I want to go have to look for one and wish that I would have been smart enough to take one when I saw one, but... You get me. <laughs> Darth tried playing the long dark with everything bad off and all the good things on, but it got so boring you had to quit. <laughs> Do that. Uh, your birch. That works. And I wonder, we don't have guts in here, do we? No, I wouldn't have dropped them way deep inside. Um, how's our travel? It's probably junk. 63. I'm going to take a hide. Um, actually, what does require? A hide and a gut. Okay. I'm going to take the hide, and when we encounter a gut, we'll take that. You were literally just walking around. Yeah, when there's nothing that can, like, uh, it, you take away all the hazards, and it's just like, hmm, new, 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 new. We still have one wolf of those four that we might have to deal with, but we also might not because three came from way over there. Is that him right there? Yeah, there he is. He's right there. Well, we're not going to worry about him. What's our bow at anyway? Uh, 95. Okay, we're good. See if there's any feathers. Yep. All right. Take a couple of sticks. I was debating. I mean, I was thinking about leaving the coal here in case we need to forge again, but. I decided against it. All 
All right, I think I saw scrap metal, yeah. Let's move you in here. Those are all for scrap. Uh, okay, we have one of you. What's in the drawer? Did I not search the drawer? Everything's gone from here except for the safe. Okay. Uh, let's make another one of you. One for the road, a nice hot one. I'll take you and I think we'll just leave. Um, I'm going to take one of these is a partial. I don't want to leave a partial here. Um, you are. We'll do that. What's our water like? Oh boy. Well, we'll collect sticks along the way. Um, I guess we're we're gonna head to the airfield. Is where we're going. You wish you could turn off class mode. Yes, you can actually. You can you can turn off every affliction, including sprains. You can, you can. All right. Y'all said... I'm not crossing there. Y'all said I was kind of taking the long way by going this way and that I should be cutting across the ice. Um, we have clear visibility. So we'll do that today. I don't feel any threat of a blizzard. I probably shouldn't have said that. Four. We'll go for 30 and then we'll eat one. There's 28. Okay, I wasn't sure if I dropped that head. That's 28, right? Yep. Two more. Hey, Shogun Streams. Welcome in. There's two cattails way over there, but we'll pass like 600 this way, so there we go. Thirty-one. 
There we go. sticks am I even actually still oh great well what's time midday we gotta go more that way And we need three more old man's beard. Where's one of these rocks? Oh, that was too far away. Uh, didn't want to fight. Let's do it and get it over with. We have a carcass over here. No feathers. feathers and we don't have the other no we still don't have the other uh oh there's the bear that's exactly where we're going okay let's pick one of those up just in case this little loot spot oh we can just wait for the bear where is the bear oh great now I lost where the oh there he is he's straight ahead all right we got to go in there there's a oh and he's coming no nope. gonna leave us with four pieces that's not gonna help this is probably gonna attract them closer let's run uh, we're gonna have to run across here I believe Actually, I wonder that we can make it right across. We should. Now, is that bear too close? Just do that and we don't have to worry about him. stem and another uh, 
Another accelerant. I have four of those on me now. Five. Wow. That's too many. I'm not sure I can carry much more. All right. Let's go. This is kind of weird, just going from Forlorn to the airfield without first going to like the camp office or somewhere like that. It's a little strange. I think we're okay, right? But my brain is so used to doing, you know, having that main base that I always seem to go back to that right now I actually feel like I'm, I'm rushing this. And I don't believe that we are. Where's Murden is where where is word of the day? He's late on the word of the day. Or did I miss it? I don't think I missed it. I didn't miss it? Okay. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Copper's gonna look one up. Where'd Murd go? You have no words. Sorry, not in a chatty mood. Okay, no worries. Copper, look up a word for somebody who's not in a chatty mood. <laughs> That'll be our word of the day. It's just called hugs. Okay, that works. I can pronounce that. I don't need a pronunciation. <laughs> I'm going to keep the bow out because I don't know, man. Sometimes. You gotta just be safe. You can do it. Or OG if you got one. Gotta be clean though. No filth. What's the meaning of that word before I try to pronounce it? Are we just going to keep going? You know what? We uh, What do we have? You're cured. Oh, right. I wanted to see about getting a gut. <laughs> yeah, cl cleaner than that. No, no gore. Come on. I mean, I guess it's not any worse than what we're witnessing in this game. up there 
Yeah, now he's down here. <laughs> I heard him. It's meant as a cooking prep for food. Spatchcock. To split, to cut or split open at the breastbone and spread to be flattened. All right, I'll give that one a, I'll, I'll give that one a pass. I just didn't want to get it back in on the topic of like, you know, when we were discussing uh, hide tanning. I didn't want to go back to that place. But cooking can be pretty, uh, pretty nasty. All right, Copper, go do what you gotta do. We'll wait. I'll wait in this truck. Hope you're not gonna be too long. <laughs> I'm just going to carry on. Let's go. There might be a gut in there. I don't know. As it stands, we're kind of carrying a 0.5 of a hide for no reason. I don't know if I had killed anything in uh, the airfield and gotten a hide out of it or a, a gut. I hope, I hope, but I don't know. I, t I t actually, I don't tend to like, like I don't like my food to look like animals. I'm that guy. I, I'm the hypocrite. The guy who absolutely loves meat. But hates that we kill animals to do it, to get it. And I don't want it to look like an animal. And if I was ever to cook meat, I would not be using a cleaver. <laughs> I, I, if I could pull it out of a package, That's good. But yeah. That's me. Man, this pack is getting kind of heavy. All right. They have a blue flare. You know what? We can leave the blue flare. What are you? 54. I don't care about you anymore. We can leave the blue flare at the, uh, at the hub. For when we go to Sundered Pass. Should we go to Sundered Pass before we go to the zone of contamination. The zone of contamination gets us a ton of coal. Yeah, they they added that update. The hand your hands will now show the proper gloves that you're wearing. Do I get, oh, I get two arrows when I'm holding it. Uh, I guess we'll continue to be blinded. Um, it'll also show the, the, the sleeve of the coat you're wearing. Uh, so I like all meats if they're made into burgers or steaks. Yeah. They can look like steaks. I just prefer if they don't have bones. 
Like I, I prefer chicken nuggets over or chicken strips or chicken breasts over like chicken wings. Bones have always grossed me out. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I, it's yeah, it's just not my thing. I've never been into bones. We definitely have yeah, been here, so let's just keep moseying. I know, I know. Bones and steaks are superior. I know. Bone and burger, not so much. Yeah, it's amazing how that works. If we put, oh, we're three arrows. Now we're one. Hey, everybody! Here's a rose hip climb. We're gonna jump down. <laughs> That I only just realized. Oh, why? Are you going to be like that? He didn't bark or anything. Did you hear that? Or what? Well, I guess you didn't, right? <laughs> Did you notice? Like, he didn't make any sound. The thing with wings that bothers me, like, I, trust me, I used to eat hot wings all the time. But the thing that bothers me about that is like every two, that's one chicken. Right? <laughs> I'm, I'm weird like that. I'm just, I'm weird like that. I would not survive in the wild. Is he coming after? Listen to him. He's at least the bunnies make sound. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Uh, let's continue grabbing sticks. We've definitely been in here before. That's where I believe this is the one we go. I should turn this on because look at this. We have coal. Okay. That's a nook. I'd survive if I was with you, Darth. You'd debone every cattail for me. Nice. Nice. seeing any more coal I, I honestly I didn't actually even expect to find one piece so that's kind of better uh, than I thought we would be <laughs> that made you laugh more harder than it should have OG <laughs> the cattail bones thing I didn't find it funny. I thought it was very, very nice. <laughs> yep. 
Meat is good. Meat is real good. Killing is not my thing. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Astrid Hush. Eat one of those. We need water. We're getting low. How many sticks are we at? We're at 18 and we have a big fat chunk of fur. Big old one kilogram piece of wood. I went to McDonald's yesterday on my way back from dropping off my PC. Oh, and by the way, I'm on the old PC today. Three to five days, they say. To fix that sound. That was coming out of it. It's a little disappointing, but whatever. I mean, things happen. I'd be mad if it was making that sound all the time, but it didn't. It never made it when I played the long dark. It made it when I was playing uh, like Red Dead or Snow Runner or Seven Days to Die. I think Seven Days to Die, it's more more so because I don't think the game is optimized as well as it could be. But I think if it was making the sound all the time, I'd be mad about the three to five days like here. Take this big fat wad of money. Give me it. This is what I went through when I bought my very first PC. I already told that story though, right? But it angers you when you buy stuff and very shortly after buying them, they so have an issue. Snow and nothing to drink. And they tell you that they want to take it back from you and have it longer than you've had it. That's a kind of infuriating. Found that out with our trailer. We bought a trailer way back. Let's take you. Our first camping trip with it. We went out. Well, actually, no, we were about to go out. We were filling it with water. And then all of a sudden we just, like, one of us went inside the trailer and just was like, water was coming out of every orifice of this trailer. And we're like, what the hell? And, uh, like it was leaking in the shower. It was leaking in the faucets. It was, uh, both in the washroom and in the, uh, in the kitchen area. And, uh, yeah, basically any assembly line stuff like that, they don't care. It's cheaper for them to just push it through and deal with it on warranty than it is to stop the line and actually fix the rip what, what needs to be done. And I don't know. I mean, I don't think that the PC was built on an assembly line, but it was built by them. And I would expect that they would test the PCs on very, very hard graphically games, if that makes sense. You know, work that sucker. Because if you would have worked it, you would have found out, hey, it makes a sound. Push it to the max. They test them, but they don't stress test them. No profit in that. Yeah. Well, I, I think in most cases, you know what the one guy told me too? He said it could be something really stupid. Like when the fans are winding up, it could just be rattling something inside the case. And uh, I thought, you know what? It, it's very possible. 
could just be some minor little well i i do think it is a minor thing i don't think it's anything like i don't think a fan is is bad or anything like that even if it is that's still fairly minor but whatever i mean it's better it happen now than like six months from now and i'm not out anything technically i do think though because you have a one month warranty i mean it does have a full one year warranty but because uh, I never buy extended warranties because I think they're a scam but uh, the the first 30 days is everything's so much easier to get things fixed right and what if it takes five days with any product if you have to bring it in for warranty the time that they have it should not it should not count towards your warranty period. Time should stop from the time you hand it to them to the time they hand it back and then it resumes again. That's what I think. Cuz I'm sure they could fix that within an hour. They'd have it done. But they don't have to send it nowhere but they do have other customers but the guy also said they're slow <laughs> who knows who cares it'll be fixed the only problem I have right now is like I can't play Red Dead on this PC I can but I have to change the settings all down to to medium or worse and I don't want to do that same with snow runner I can't I can play snow runner on here it's just every once in a while it uh, it'll freeze for about two seconds but if it freezes while you're going around a corner <laughs> Copper's back. The 30 days should start over if you have to take it in. I like that idea too. Usually whenever they fix though, they, they usually give like a proper time limit for that. But the rest of the stuff is, is just still on that original timer. Things are definitely not, I mean, the old days, I mean, everything was built to last. These days, everything is built to break. That's obviously not what's going on with my PC, but. Is SnowRunner like a trucking simulator? Yeah, it's, it's like an off-road game where you use actual work trucks and you haul materials around um the maps and uh yeah he got like mud snow rocks lots of times yeah you, you got I, I refer to it as spider manning where you're just like winching to, from this tree to the next tree to the next tree Did you hear my nice chair right there? <laughs> I love this chair. Not really, but... Yeah, it's, it's more of an off-road game, but you do drive like big trucks. Nope, I was just moving my, my butt in my chair. My back is sore today because the weather. It's frosty today. Well, it's not actually frosty. It's like, I think it was seven degrees when I was outside earlier. Mm. 
Ooh, Murd wants a stretch. Right after I get comfy, Murd's like, hey, pull off a stretch now. You gotta move again. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. There we go. Now I have to try and find a way of getting more comfortable. I, that's why I really liked when my mic was above my head, but apparently the sound isn't as good. Because then I could move around. I'm checking up here. I'm pretty sure I got the arrows from up here. Or the arrow. Yeah. We should probably just spend the night here. Well, we need water, so... We may as well do this. You know what? Use the matches. Oh, why is it not giving us a hundred? Well, weren't the cardboard matches giving us a hundred percent yesterday for something? Maybe I had accelerant or something I was using. I don't know. Come on, little fire. All right. We'll get two liters. Um, 25. I'm going to throw the fur. And let's go have a peek. I don't know if this coal out here ever respawns or not. I don't think it does. But I can grab the scrap metal if I haven't already grabbed it. And... Nope. How much cloth do we have? 17. Oh, I gotta put... I might... Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna take the deer hide. I'm keeping the deer hide. Okay, so there is no respawn coal. Apparently it doesn't do that. Aside from feathers, you didn't know loot could respawn. Well, coal, coal's not really loot. Coal is one of the respawnable items in the game. It just doesn't respawn everywhere. Like, in, it, it will respawn in caves. But I think the stuff that you find outdoors, I think that stuff doesn't respawn. Oh, that was just that. Okay. That's where the newspaper needs to go. Uh, let's, I guess, take a look at our clothing. I should actually... That's 77. Let's do it. Let's get rid of these. Let's go down. Make sure there's nothing in there. Okay. Where is it? I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna just leave it in here. 25 sticks. I think we're gonna take those. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Or at least as many that we can take. 
after we've done that. 124, that should, you know what, use one extra piece. What's the worst that can happen? You have to pick up one more stick. All right, I think let's try and make a repair, maybe two on some items. 88. I don't think we're going to do it. Oh, I guess with the fire we will. Yeah, there we go. Coach's boots are at 100. Uh, we have, we still have 18 and we have 14 cloth. That's good. I'm tired. There we go. All right. Uh, so we, I guess we'll just eat the meat. Um, the canned goods I'm going to leave behind, I think. Let's do that. Uh, let's take a sip. All right, cans. Y'all can go down here. There we go. All right, what do we got for water? 332. Well, I have to pick it up anyway because I need those. I'll leave a little bit of water here. Not lots, just a little. We go out this door. Yeah. Off we go. Off to the airfield. Minus 22 on the wind. Great. And it's not even coming from the left. It's, I think it's coming from that direction. Sometimes hard. I mean, does it matter which way the clouds are moving? Is that like, does that mean it's moving from that direction? I don't know. You want to go visit Murd in the winter? <laughs> it gets pretty cold down under. Yeah, Murd's cold is like my morning today. I think in Australia, Mert can probably correct me, but I think in Australia, they look around like, ooh, I better put some long sleeves on. <laughs> So we can take the goat because we've been through this whole area. I mean, we spawned in this region. We've been to, uh, we've, we've been both routes, I believe, right?
now I'm questioning. Yeah, I don't, I, I think when we left, we went the long way. I don't think we took the shortcut. Or did we? Oh, I don't know. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Whatever, I'm gonna go. And that's all I have to say about that. This wind. Sometimes I do wish that they had a, a little part of the, the HUD that would show you the direction of the wind. Because, I mean, I don't think that it, it's always obvious. And this pack is getting kind of heavy. I guess you can watch those little wisps that go by. But come on, give me the stick. Wait, I'm so cold. I'm warming up a bit. <laughs> You're going to show up on Merd's doorstep wearing a Dundee hat. And vest with skinny jeans and cowboy boots. <laughs> Still early morning. I guess it's mid morning, right? Crocodile OG. <laughs> That's awesome. That's a good one. Yeah, we adapt in Canada, we adapt to our weather. 10 degrees in the summer is cold, 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 10 degrees in the winter and you're like walking around in t-shirt and shorts saying, man, it's amazing out today. <laughs> Copper's purring because she loves the long walks. Somebody's got a... Yeah, you and Raph. <laughs> Copper and Raph. They're the only two that love these long walks. it so much if it wasn't always windy but I mean you're right down in this valley so the wind is just gonna come flying through here Ooh, look at all of you pretty sticks pretty 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 Thought I missed these two, didn't you? I was putting my coffee down. I don't want to get too many sticks. 32. I mean, I don't want to get somewhere and find out we got 17 kilograms worth of sticks. This walk is bad enough without the wind. <laughs> well, you add the wind into it, you're like, ah, oh, do I really want to go there? Oh, 
OG likes long walks on short piers. Isn't it long walk on a short dock? Because it rhymes. That's what we always used to say. Oh, come on. It's, it's given us little bits of windbreaks, not enough to show on the screen, but enough to let us walk fast, and it's kind of mimicking the wobble when you're near death. I mean, it is a relatively steep cliff we're going down. All right. Be very, very careful. We don't want to get another one. saw me there we go he saw us but he I don't think he can go up that slope right All right, I know I said that I don't need 600,000 sticks but they're right here and we're going right in there and we're about to throw like 20 sticks on the fire probably, so... Um... So, you know what? We can just make a fire here. Aha! 95! And you know what? We can get rid of one of these. You're wearing bright red on white snow, shocked something sees him. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a good one. All right, we'll throw one of you and check the what, uh, what is the temperature. All right, and let's drop that. Let's do that. I forgot I was going to get rid of the hacksaw. I don't think we need it anymore. I was going to take all the meat because there's not a lot, right? But then I thought, eh. 2.8, I may as well. Five more minutes. If fourteen minutes. Well, we're not gonna take the hide, be it. We have no no point. But we will take the guts because at least if we don't have any guts here already, we can get some on the go. Maybe. 
Maybe I should have left that point eight. Because now we're just going to be here a little bit longer. Um, what do we got in there? Okay, we got all that. What do we want to eat? Oh, I guess right there. Who has... Hey, Eddie. Welcome in. Who has actually eaten wolf meat? Not me. Not me. Thirty-one minutes. That should be fine. We'll just speed it up. Oh no, is the weather turned? It has, it has. Um, we got six old man's beard. Okay, good. Make sure to take all the bones out. Yeah. How many sticks do we have? 42. 42 because aside from using a stick to start the fire, I didn't throw a single one on there. Smart guy would have heated something up to drink. That's not us though. Alright, if I can get over there, we might get a wind block. Yeah, it would be pretty hard to eat a wolf just because they are basically dogs, right? Same with like large cats. I don't, I don't know that people hunt them and eat them. Like cougars and such. type of bread everyone <laughs> good change of topic that's a better topic Two bars of scent. I wonder if we'll have a wolf or three. 
Appear on the tarmac. Alright, I'm going in here. There we go. Now we're warm. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Did I leave? Okay, that's a previous run where I left matches in there. And... I guess I don't need to be carrying these. And... We don't need you. Let's put you right there. And I guess drop those. Put that like that. Alright, here are our clothing that we can break down. What do we what's the time? Hmm. Let's drop them all. We'll take two. Uh, let's eat. That guy who drank his own pee doesn't seem so crazy right now. And we'll drink and we're just gonna, we're gonna carry on. This is just a regular storm, right? Like it's not, yeah, it's, it's just a snowstorm. Maybe this is a bad idea. This might not be a good idea. Nifo, go, go, go. <laughs> Sounds like a blizzard. It still doesn't really look like one. Yeah, maybe we should turn around. My my thinking on this was if I could get at least to the cabin, we'd be real close if Glimmerfog kicked in or an Aurora. I'm freezing. Hey coach, welcome in. How you doing, bud? You're okay, I see it says. Uh, what can we do? See, now it doesn't sound like a blizzard anymore, but I think it actually almost is a blizzard. Let's go just have a peek down. Oh, hey. Uh, did I have any of these out here already? No. Let's go have a peek downstairs and just see what's there. I don't remember what we may have left. Oh, a gut. That's why. What are you doing down in the basement? Well, we can repair the travois now. That's what we can do. The sled shall be fixed. Let's shut you off, save some fuel. Um, put you there. Yeah, we're good. 63, what are you going to... Oh. <laughs> Pick up the deer hide, fool. Put you there. Uh, what are you going to go to?
Oh, you went right to a hundred. Nice. All right, what's the what's the weather like now? Do we need any? No, we don't need water. Okay, let's go. We're fully warm. I think we can make it there. I don't know. Um, sometimes you just have to commit to something and just do it. Just got to go all in. I'd rather be at the cabin than at the at the the hangar, honestly. I'll go around this big rock because I think we might get a wind block for a little bit. a matter of not missing the turn but I think the visibility is good it would be nice if we could get up there and this is the worst the weather gets because there can be a deer up there to get a moose here before we leave unless we want to come back one day Cheer up, Murder Knife. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't see one here, so it means we probably have the guy out there. that little da -da. what is that sound is it discord did I not shut down my discord absolutely hate how they hide um, all the alerts and stuff the sounds that's y'all chatting in discord <laughs> that's fine normally I actually shut especially on this computer whoa 
Normally I close Discord because it uses resources. And I forgot to do it because I don't have to do that on the new PC. the cabin we had a wolf so now uh, what is the time it's almost night time i think we have enough time to warm up and come out and check and see if there's a deer up there fisherman sweater I picked up the scrap metal from the basement there's the hovering oats let's just leave the hovering oats uh, I picked up the scrap metal from the basement with intent to leave it on the main floor and then I forgot. <laughs> so that's why we have it. All right, uh, Kawachan, we want to repair you. Finally, double Kawachans. Well, I don't believe we actually had that at all in our previous run. The oats want you to take them, so they hover. The oats can quit hovering, and then maybe I'll take them. I need to find a place to rest. <laughs> you just swore I said double chow, double cowchins. No, cowchins. Cowchin. Close enough. <laughs> Alright, what do we... What do we got? Uh, we don't really need... Oh, wait. We have three bandages. Eh, whatever, I'm gonna make... We'll have five. Five is better than three. Four is perfect. Yeah, everything, everything we have, we're going to take it. Oh, it's nighttime. Okay. Well, got to drink that last little bit because we're going to be dry when we wake up. sounds nicer uh, we're not fully there we go we're not fully rested all right curtains it's about the only thing we can do till daylight yeah that was there we go. Drinking before bedtime such a bad idea in real life. Good luck sleeping 10 hours with a full bladder. 
I drink before I go to bed. Oh, I can't hit that from there. I didn't want to have to move. Take that. We'll take these ones too. And then we'll go look for a deer. I didn't see any, like, I don't know if the, if this area would have moose markings or not. Cause it's basically out on the lake, right? But we can have a peek and see if possibly a moose might be out there. there you know what we're way closer to the deer than we are to the the moose that we we're pretty sure isn't going to be there anyway so we may as well go after the deer first or at least try to see if there is one There's a deer out here. Well, let's go see if there's a buck. A buck? A moose. Jesus, this is cold. Shush, Astrid. Let's go warm up first. And then we'll go see. Is this a drop? Not really. Hey! It's still after us! <laughs> Good one, Darth. Alright, what do we got? We can repair your 90. Let's repair you. You go up by 0.2, the socks will only go up by 0.1. Point two, that's an hour, whatever. We have we have lots and lots and lots. Twenty pieces of cloth. Uh where's the door? Right there. for a moose. What did we have for sticks? Seven. And a book. We'll go have a little look for a wolf. Not a wolf. A, a moose. We might... I don't know. We, we don't have any visible scent. So I don't think we'll get any wolves. But maybe we might get a glimmer fog. And we can go up in there. <laughs> Could you imagine if animals knew just how flimsy some doors or windows are to get into your homes? would be interesting, wouldn't it? I still remember one of my first cats, Monkey. Uh, we had a we had a cat-free room 
in our house. And one day my dad was going to come over and spend the night. And so that would be his bedroom. So we wanted to go in and just make sure everything was all good. Go down the hallway. We see the doors open a little bit. Like why is the door doing open? There's monkey laying on the bed. <laughs> I've never felt so cold in my life. He figured out how uh, we, we had the lever style door handles. So he figured out how to push those down. And that was not cool because we liked those. We liked our door hardware. We didn't want to switch to a regular knob. We also didn't want a cat in the room that was not supposed to have cats. Alright. We're freezing again. Feels like minus 13. no moose over there so it probably will be the one way out by that other cabin your cats know how to use the lever doors coach yeah they're smart man they figure it out they're like hey look what I can do now <laughs> I guess we're gonna go to the plane first and we'll come back and then I don't know somewhere in there I think the helicopter might be there um, I mean we may as well just continue our that sounds Oh, I thought that was glimmer fog coming in. Oh, let's go. I thought that was glimmer fog. You've seen bears sitting at glass doors wanting what was inside and simply stood there because they didn't know how to get in past this reflection. If you, if you go into... It is probably the enter at your own risk. If you go in there, I posted a moose. A moose fight that was in somebody's backyard. In Alaska. Two moose going at it. And... A lot of people, including myself, had the same idea. That lady's got a lot of faith in that glass. <laughs> oh, hello, Mr. Bear. There's a bunny. I don't know if you can see that bunny ripping across the ice. Shoulder late. You saw that just wrecked the lady's fancy. Oh yeah, I wrecked everything, man. That was pretty vicious. Oh, we got the sport bow. Thank you. 
We got the sport bow. I'll take it. And that is a fire starting book. That is good. Got wolves out there. Yeah, that's a good find, eh? It's nice to find it in the first place you actually look. <laughs> And now you don't really have to look anymore. Oh, I hate this. Annoying. Uh, I didn't even notice. We're not warming up in here, are we? Minus seven. We got to have a lot of feathers by now. Point four one. Wow. There's some deer out there. There's some wolves out there. Uh, there's a bear right there. We need a fire is what we need. The far cottage now has arrows, but no need to go there. Oh, we're going there. But I kind of want to get this bunker before we do our loop. Because what I don't want is to be way out there. And then we get glimmer fog. I kind of want to maybe hover around this area. You can lob an arrow. We need a fire though. We got to get a fire. Let's do this. Which way did he just turn? He is he was definitely actually on our scent there. I don't know. Um, let's go in here though. Kinda wish you could not go in here <laughs> but what I wish is that I could get somewhere in here where I could still see where the bear is I don't even know okay the wind is obviously coming from that way and we can do that let's do that we don't need that. We got 100% anyway. It just makes the fire start quicker. Which is why I guess it would be called accelerant, right? But I don't want to waste it. On, little fire. Oh, lucky day. Oh, ho. And we'll do one piece of coal and we'll do that many sticks. Do I if I don't warm up soon? And we'll just do this. Are we safe? Whoa, that was trippy. Uh, how much water we got? 252. Well, let's, uh, birch bark. And 
Let's do the, let's do this. Why not, right? It's high noon. Let's do a little bit of water so we can pass time. I wonder if I can drop it. We got two twenty on there. It's it's a nice day. Look at all the bunnies. Ah, it's hard when they're walking either directly toward. Yeah, he's coming this way. Kind of moonwalking there. Let's hang out over here. Oh, we can go up there. We can go up top while well, the weather's nice. I do kind of want to stay right over here though, but who knows? Maybe we can get a shot on the bear from up top. Surprise them. They'll never know what hit them. I'm in a hurry to get there too. I don't know why. Ah. Oh. I need I think I'm in a hurry because I'm worried I've been kind of lost up here before in a terrible blizzard I don't want that to happen it's no fun I'm going to see if I can get a shot off on him. Oh, okay. That's not even close to going to happen. I wonder where you would even aim. Where would you think to aim? Like there? Because it's going to have to drop. You can see those bunnies. He's going to part those bunnies like the Red Sea. Oh, well. He's going to get back and you see that fire and be like, hey, this wasn't here when I left. I like these trees. They have a nice slope to get up. No big fat root. I forget what was even up here. If there's, there's gotta be a reason to come up here. We got a little bag. You gotta take off OG. All right. Thank you for coming by. And you have a great day. Oh, we just have a shallow cave. That's all we have. Oh no. All right. Is that bag really in this little, this is, we, we toughed it out in this little shallow nook here. Is that all that's really up here though? Just that bag? And maybe a visual of, of the land. Oh, there's the helicopter. We don't need to go there, but we, we will. That is another sport bow location, but we already have the sport bow. Gold, because I really do. Wow, 
Well. We may as well go to the helicopter. We know where it is. Get this out of the way. Wait. I'm so cold. I'm is this going to be a cliff? Yeah, it's a little too steep. I think going left is the way to go, but I'm going to just check out if we can get down this way too. Uh, you know what? I'm taking the safe route. Oh, that bear is not too far. There he is. Um, yeah, he's kind of blocking our path. here got a headshot and we got a shoulder shot he came right up here Damn. I don't know Freezing. I don't know if the travel is gonna work Son of a... Well, there it was. <laughs> Shut up, pain. Uh, uh, we need a bandage and a painkiller. Damn it. <laughs> Stupid sled. Okay. That hurts so much. Oh. That and... You know what? I'm going to... Ah, what the hell? We're by a fire. I don't need to warm it up. Oh, there you go. We have stepped on a fire. <laughs> it happened. It's the sled, man. I'm going to blame the sled. I mean, it doesn't help that there was a lip there, too. I thought I was on fairly flattish. I mean... You go over there, you... Actually, we can eat... Probably one of these. Well, we can eat them both. And copper missed it. <laughs> uh -huh. Let's go with six. You missed two events, copper. We got 11 minutes. All 
All right. Oh, that was weird. Yeah, Mert called that, or or shall we say, Mert jinxed that a couple days ago. You know what? What's the better way right there? All right, 11 minutes. clicking and I, uh, I guess you can't eat from there anyway so uh, why am I worried I shouldn't be worried I'm not sure I can carry much more because you can just double click on them so there's no worry yeah kind of wish I didn't put them in my pots though Like I wish I would have just been cooking them on the on the stone. Cause this timing is not working. Get six pieces and then I get three pieces. Mr. Bear. Can I just take all eight? Yeah. Nine minutes. do that because I want to hypothermia wouldn't kill me eat that drink up a little bit I wonder how does that uh how does stepping on a fire affect your clothing no oh, I kept that actually that's good that I kept it because yeah I think it's all right uh, 38 minutes. Yeah, let's just take the hide first. I was wondering if you like your, your shoes and your, your pants might take a, a hit because of the fire. How long is the guts going to be? An hour ten, so we need about. Ah, oh, we're good. I really hope that this is able to make it down this hill. Ten minutes. Ah, oh, man. Take you. Let's take you. Go here, I guess. Um, uh, actually, what I'm gonna do is that... I'll drink some of that. And 
and we'll just take all the guts in one shot. I really hope this sled goes down this hill. I, you know, when I shot this bear the first time, I thought, I actually thought it, it would make him run away. I did not expect it to not make him run. Um, we need a hot drink again. I don't want to keep using, yeah, let's use the mushrooms. I don't want to keep using my birch bark because pretty soon we're not going to have any. We got you. Let's go. If the bear can make it, we should be able to. Or not. I'm completely stuck. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Wasn't it Murd saying that when he gets stuck on a on a hill? Uh, too much to carry. He just are we moving? No, we're not. Um close that. There we go. When he gets oh when I thought, was it Murd said when he gets stuck on a hill, it just opens and closes, opens and closes or whatever, or picks up or drops, picks up and drops. Oh, this is going to suck. That's not even funny. Copper. Just so much meat. What a crappy place to take them out. Um, oh, I wish I could just throw everything in there, but I can't. It would be so much quicker. Get rid of you. Please. Uh, I can't carry this any further. Oh, man. You know what? I'm dropping it this way. This is where you hate the sled, but I, I'm telling you, this is still better than not having it. I have to just go right here. By the time we get done dealing with this, it's going to be too dark to know where I'm supposed to go. Okay, let's do that. This should be a safe spot. for having a hot drink. Are you in there? There we go. All right, now we have to find where's the bunker now? Mm 
I'll try and sit up a little bit so I can see a little better. I hope we're going the right way. Worst case scenario, we just go right back all the way to uh, the hangar. It might not actually even be a bad idea to just do that anyway. I think maybe, yeah, we have visibility. Why not just go back to the bunker, whatever, or sorry, the, the hangar. That way we know where the guts are. We don't have to worry about transporting it and we can uh, continue our loop. I think we're gonna have to go this way. I hope this isn't too steep. That other one was frustrating because it was so steep that it, like, it just stopped us and we couldn't even back up. This is where the moose would be if the moose was out. It's so cold. I just want to lay down if it was in this location. And we need to go this way. Lots of dots. It's a different kind of pretty sky. Let's go straight that away. I wonder if we're gonna actually gain our condition back. If we drink a herbal tea and a birch bark, will we get our condition all back. I am not sure. I don't want to stop to make a fire and warm up either. We'll just deal with the condition that we've lost. Um, I guess the side benefit of going back here, I can get rid of that scrap metal I had no intention of bringing. I think it would be far more useful at the, uh, at the hangar than it would be in our pocket. Quite the journey though, but we got a bear. We just need to get a moose now. Mr. Coach, thank you so much for the bits. Did 
Did you just do it twice? Or did it play it twice? <laughs> You did do it twice, didn't you? I think you did. Thank you. I'm still not sure with my sound alerts. I'm still not sure. Either way, even if you only did it once, I'm still, that's still very generous. Thank you so much. Look at where we are. Whoa, auto walk. <laughs> right, everything. Oh, some of this gear behind. And raw meat. And drop all this. And I think that should be it, yeah. Let's go inside. All right, we'll drop the guts. A little bunny, you can go right there. Guts can go there. The bear hide can go there. Uh, scrap metal. You know what? Uh, it's better off downstairs. I should have just left it. I mean, there's a forge down there, right? What's the point in moving it away from the forge? I honestly don't really understand why I picked it up. You can go there. You can go there. We have some sticks. We have some books. That's all right. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. All right. We are going to eat. And we want one of you. We want one of you. We're down to seven. I think that's still a pretty good amount. Let's do that and make sure everything's good. Okay. All right. I think I'll end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, if you like what you saw, please like and subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow.